a season as you can possibly have. The year the Cavs were supposed to win an NBA championship and the year the city of Cleveland was set to celebrate. I guess you have to go through some, a lot of nightmares before you finally you know, accomplish your dream, and that's what's going on um, individually for myself. If he leaves, it would be a disaster of enormous proportions to the Cavaliers. The Cleveland fans wondering if that's the last time he'll take off a Cavalier jersey. The Lakers repeat back-to-back -back titles. The LA Lakers, the 2010 NBA champions. And this fall, I'm going to take my talents to South Beach and join the Miami Heat. LeBron James, here he comes, hitting ahead for Wade. There he goes! Oh! Goes inside. Well, you've never been one to back away from a challenge. What kind of expectations do you set for yourself individually going into year three? It's high. The way I look at it within myself, why not? Why can't I be the MVP of the league? Why can't I be the best player in the league? I don't see why. Why? why? Well, you got to get something here. That's big on the left side. Pressure, drive it to the basket, does it again. And a chance for a three-point play as he 
Jeremy Lin, are you following that story at all? No idea. I know who he is, but I don't really know what's going on too much with him. Are you surprised at the production that Lin's had over the past week? I don't even know what he's done. I, I, like, I, don't, I have no idea what you guys are talking about. I'm reading all these quotes that, about what he's saying. Kobe Bryant has no idea who Jeremy Lin is. So I'm like, what? I'm like, why would you do that? I didn't say anything about you. I, I never talked bad about you. So when I heard that, I was like, here we go. Would you consider guarding him if, if he's having one of those games? Good. <laughs> 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 There is a, a new man in town. May the best man win. Over under 23 points for Lynn tonight, Bomani. So against the Lakers with those trees they've got inside, it won't be so Lynn sane tonight. Kobe or Lynn? Who scores more tonight? I'm going with my guy, Jeremy Lynn. <laughs> right here. Because I you might do all, that. all he does is Lynn. <laughs> But uh, do you think Kobe knows who you are now? If they ask me that question, I'm going to be like, who the hell is Kobe? That's what I was going to say. I don't think Derrick Rose will ever be Derrick Rose again, even though he just turned 25 years of age. He down wrong on the left foot. Now, whether it was an ankle or a knee, I do not know. It's a devastating blow for the NBA. Uh, we, I mean, we, of course, we want to get to that. Of course, it's our goal is to win a championship. I think if we stay, stay on the path that we're on now, we'll have a good chance. We just got to come out and play hard every single night and improve every single day we step on the court. This is Durant. Oh, and a foul. Thanks a lot, guys. And by the way, there's no maybe about it. Definitely between yourself, Kevin Durant, and LeBron James for League MVP awards. I think everybody would, would, would agree with that. It's the last time I'm looking at all y'all in your eyes. Y'all not champions. That's why I'm getting a good look. It's the last time I look at y'all in your eyes. Y'all not champions. The foul called, and now Dwayne Wade and LeBron James will come out of the game to the roar of the crowd. The Miami Heat are once again NBA champions. LeBron James captures that elusive title he so desperately coveted.
The Cleveland Cavaliers select. Anthony Bennett Whoa! of Toronto, Canada, and the University of Nevada, Las Vegas. Who, in your opinion, Stephen, is the biggest NBA bust of all time? NBA bust? How about Anthony Bennett, the number one overall pick of the Cleveland Cavaliers? You talking about a bust? It doesn't get much worse than that. It's Chalmers. Thomas Hawes breaking it through the Sixers with this group. They want to run.
this is amazing. You guys in the stands, I want to thank everyone for being here. You guys are unbelievable that made this possible. I don't know if you guys know what happened in the last month with me deciding to come back and play here. It's people that came to me and said, LeBron, you got to do what makes you happy. And I was like, yeah, I think so. And also, I'm going to do what makes my city and my state happy. And that's why I came back. I love you. I'm back. So Smart forced it. Here come the Cavs. Irving for LeBron! It's all Cleveland here in the third. They lead by 14. The loss again! That's a lot of play! They have not run that play in the preseason. Ennis! Look out below! James Ennis!
trailing Anthony Davis. Curry in the corner, shoots, on the way, got it! He hit it! 2.8 to go! Curry does it again! This is it is amazing what Steph Curry can do with a basketball. I feel confident because I'm the best player in the world. That's simple. Curry rifle pass to Iguodala. And it's a 10-point lead. Cavs ball timeout. Curry for three. Puts it in. Stephen Curry from downtown. Green picks it out. Iguodala. His three-point attempt. Got it. The Golden State Warriors are the 2015 NBA champions. Their first title in 40 years. And how sweet it must be for those crazy loyal Bay Area fans. He is the first unanimous selection in the entire history of the NBA. He is a player who reinvents the game every time he takes the floor. Folks, Steph Curry, like McDonald's, doesn't have to be the best burger, but McDonald's is the most influential restaurant in American history. Okay, Steph Curry is the reason the Lakers and Mavs shot 77 threes and Duke and Kansas shot 65. Go to a gym in America now. Kids aren't backing up to the basket. They walk into a gym and they hoist threes. Steph Curry has killed the mid-range jumper. He's killed a shot. He's eliminated centers. You can't be on the floor in the NBA now if you can't shoot a three. Has the basketball, gives it up. Yeah. How old was you? How, what you like? As if everyone was making fun of me 
You were 30, she was 19. Scary. You will notice also the crown this team is the greatest regular season record of all time. What's going through your mind as a grizzly? Well, you might as well just get it. My brother used to break in our house and steal the TV. But now he's dead. And the other forward for the final time, number 24 on the floor, 6 Head coach Byron Scott. We are here to celebrate greatness for 20 years. Excellence for 20 years. Five and a half to go. He's got a shot there. Brian gets to the basket and has 47 points. Guarded by Hayward. 48 and 49. Going to the basket. It's official number 73. The greatest regular season in NBA history now belongs to the 2016 Golden State Warriors. valuable player in the league he's the most valuable asset in the league because he he just changes everything but when I'm watching that finals last night because of the explosion of the three-point shot um I, I, I he is not as impactful uh as he used to be and, and it's not like I'm watching the end of an era but LeBron just is going to remain in this league but he reminds me a little bit now LeBron James reminds me a little bit now of a pitcher post Tommy John surgery is that LeBron James is 31. Uh, he doesn't dunk as much. You're not going to get a 45-point night from him. Those days are over. He's a human being. He's played 1,200 games. Cleveland now is building around a really, really valuable asset and a terrific player and an all-time great. In the end, we're seeing the LeBron that is 31, is not going to chase you down and block from behind, is not going to slam dunk as much, or with the, the volume he did. He is no longer an A-plus scorer and an A-plus defender and an A-plus this, that, and everything. He is really A-minus to B-plus at everything. And so he's no longer Superman, he's now Batman.
LeBron facing elimination obviously doesn't phase you. in games five and six. Triple double in game seven. Bring a championship to his beloved hometown. This is for you. With all the expectations of the world heaped on his shoulders, who led the team, who led both teams in the finals in points, rebounds, assists, steals, and block shots. You are unbelievable. Five scoring champion, former MVP Kevin Durant has decided to move to the Golden State Warriors. That damn Kevin Durant ruined my season. I'm trying to tell you right now. Heading to the Golden State Warriors, how are you viewing this move from Durant? Well, I'm viewing it as the weakest move I've ever seen from a superstar. Plain and simple, that's just how I look at it. You're going to the team that beat you when you were 48 minutes away on three separate occasions from beating them yourself. It's not that he's leaving Oklahoma City. It's the team that he's going to. In all my years of covering sports, the more I think about this, I've never seen anything quite like it. How in God's name did Russell Westbrook find out from the media that you Now by Robertson, then has words, they're going to count the basket. Now Durant and Robertson go forehead to forehead. Durant still talking to him. You did it when you left, and you didn't even have the decency to see him face to face, man to man, and tell him. Or for that matter, pick up the phone and tell him. It's actually a smart foul from Draymond Green to stop what may have been an easy dunk. Durant says something to Westbrook as he walks past him. Westbrook responds. All good competitive fun right now. And literally looked Russell Westbrook in the face and told him, I'm not leaving. The Pistols going to have to step in sooner or later. Some records are meant to be broken, but. Wow. Swap, 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 I mean, I feel me. Nope. There's not one guy on this planet who can do it. I think that's one of those records that will never be touched. I don't think that's going to have to be there. Uh, not for a whole year. What Oscar did with the triple double, that would never happen. Never. The deflection, but right to Westbrook. seen anything like this man Russell Westbrook I to tell you it's got to be Westbrook it's not just that he's averaging a triple double but the rest of us would say you're not gonna average a triple yeah. double especially not when you're six foot three he's a flat-out absolute terror on the basketball court he plays with zero doubt and zero conscience and I mean that in, in a, the most positive compliment, complimentary way of all Westbrook, not a bad move. Right around Holiday. And one thing Holiday is really good at is anticipating 
and guessing right. Corey's right there. What happened, man? Because it just seemed like, you know, one minute you're in the championship, you're in the finals, you know, you're hugging LeBron, you're happy to be in Cleveland, you're looking forward to coming back to compete for another championship, and then the next minute you want out. What happened? But once you have one championship, you have wiggle room to do whatever you want to do. Wow. Kyrie wants to be the man now. Of course, if he stays with LeBron, he can get three, four, five, six, but guess what? That's not gonna happen. He wants to be the man now, so he said, I'm going to Boston. Boston Celtics and Cleveland Cavaliers have agreed to a trade that will send Kyrie Irving to Boston and Isaiah Thomas packing for Cleveland. The Cleveland Cavaliers don't even look like a team right now. They just look like a bunch of partners that have been put together. There's no cohesion. With Derrick them. Rose has left the Cavaliers and is reconsidering his future playing basketball. Left the team and is thinking about walking away maybe from the NBA. Rose is unsure about his future in the NBA. This is a very dispirited, disjointed group of Cavaliers right now. I mean, I already gave this guy the MVP. I I mean, I if James Harden doesn't win, it will be a joke. He has been unstoppable. Shout out to all the youngest, man. I got a dream. It's a vision out there. Go take it. Go chase that dream. James Harden has single handedly made the Rockets a championship contender.
Isaiah Thomas, Channing Fry, their 2018 first round pick for Larry Nance Jr., Jordan Clarkson. Woj, let's talk to let, let's talk about how they pulled this off and then the domino of deals they have done since then. Well, they, they've transformed their roster today in Cleveland. And, and what Kobe Altman wanted to get done today was to get younger, more athletic, better defensively. And, and the term that I heard from Cleveland today was, we need a culture reset. And after all kinds of bad news lately for South Florida sports fans tonight, there is finally a big reason to smile. Today was my first day here, and I felt as comfortable today as I felt since I left. And I'm definitely excited to be back. Um, and um, the jersey and the colors fit, so. <laughs> ring, ring, ring. And he says, guess who's back? Back again. D Wade's back. Tell a friend. That magic moment. Back home, Eric. Rebound goes to the Cavs. J.R. Smith brings it back out. Throws to the hill. Hill shot blocked. You are trying. You're hoping against hope to somehow steal a win on the road. And after all of that, J.R. Smith thinks he's going to dribble out the ball. <laughs> and now you got to try and beat Golden State again on the road. I'm Kevin Durant way outside. outside. Delivers. Kevin Durant from downtown. It's a six-point game. There's a new dynasty in the NBA. The Golden State Warriors champions once again. Back to back titles. Three and four years. Deal is final. The Spurs will send Kawhi Leonard and Danny Green to the Raptors for DeMar DeRozan, Jakob Hurdle, and a 2019 first round pick. League sources tell me. The Raptors and Spurs are getting on a trade call with the league office momentarily to finalize the deal. Well, I, I was told uh, that Kawhi Leonard really has no desire to play in Toronto. Both of these guys have said they don't really want this deal to go. They're not happy with all, all this. How does that work for a, a player like that? So he ain't happy. It looks like Kawhi's not going to be happy because he may be going to Toronto, which I believe is the exact opposite of Los Angeles. Yeah. <laughs> if you think Kawhi's going to be mad that he's in Toronto now, Wait till he finds out about Canadian taxes. <laughs> and by the way, there are reports he is not happy about going to Toronto. We've got breaking news. LeBron is a Laker. LeBron James is a Los Angeles Laker for what ought to occupy the final act of his NBA story. Four-year, $154 million, a max deal. That's, that's what he can sign. The Greek Freak is a monster. He is coming. I pick and roll. Giannis on the loose. Oh, he did. Oh, For NBA history, you got it. 14 threes in a game. It's never been done. Unbelievable. A cloud piercing. 
it's refreshing to me to still see you do what you do. Gets it back to him, and that's it! He's going into the Hall of Fame. He's got three rings. He's an NBA Finals MVP. And he's universally recognized as one of the greatest off guards in the history of basketball. Wade against Iguodala. Five seconds left. Waiters back to Dwayne. Shoots. No, he couldn't get it off. Now fires it up. Back it in! As simple as this, Wade County, I love you. Only thing I'm missing now is the opportunity. Rose, Derrick Rose has 41. Rose out of the corner, and it's a new career high for Derrick Rose. The stop, the go, the finish, 46 for Rose. Rose gets inside, puts up a tough shot, and hits it anyway. 48. Exum has it blocked in the corner by who else? Dylan, 2011 MVP, Rose. The playoff matchups are determined. It's another amazing regular season in the books. Now, let's take a look at the Eastern Conference playoff bracket that won't feature a LeBron James. First time since 2005. Here it comes again. Two to the middle. Oh, Miles! Fast for Jordan to Murray! With the slam! Bring it back smooth! The Golden State Warriors win in six games and now advance to the Western Conference semifinals. We'll win. Champions, the Raptors, the 2019 NBA champs.